For Dallas Sound Guys, this is Scott. Today we're doing a conference for couples. We have 36 couples. What I wanted to mention today is how we are using the Shure Axion digital microphones, and in particular, we're using the ADX transmitters. We also have a Spectrum Manager. Okay, so what does that mean for your event? Why is that important? What I did was in Workbench, I did my frequency coordination and set up for eight wireless microphones, but I was also able to find 39 backup channels. Now, why would you need a backup channel? Just in case there might be interference or if you had a bad channel, as you can see on the far right, as we're starting to get out of the wireless microphone range and into the cell phone range, um, that these frequencies get used by other people. And so uh, this actually uh, came in super handy yesterday where uh, one of the microphones started to, the quality started to look questionable to me. And so I was able to automatically switch to a really super clean frequency. And this is also done with this Showlink access point that not only is the wireless microphone communicating with the microphone receiver, how it typically does, but it also has a second signal um, where I can send information to it. I can lock the body pack or the handheld. I could unlock it. I could change the gain on it. But most importantly, I can change the frequency. And that's what happened yesterday. Um, again, uh, everything was running well, um, but I thought the channel looked questionable. And if it went from questionable to bad, that would be noticeable during the show. Um, so I didn't let it get that far. I was monitoring um, in Workbench on the monitor tab where I can see a timeline of the different frequencies that I'm using. Uh, one of them didn't look right. And so um, I just set it to next best uh, available frequency. That's what it did. And then, I mean, it was the highest quality channel. So super happy uh, to be using the Shure Axion Digital and in particular, the uh, Spectrum Manager and the ADX transmitters. Um, this is like elite pro level equipment um, that can make a huge difference. This has happened more than once too. Last week, this happened as well, where I had a channel that started, again, uh, its quality uh, started lacking uh, just because maybe something else in the area in, uh, in RF, uh, and it just it turned into a bad frequency, switched it to an awesome frequency, um, and the show was flawless. Um, happy to bring this to your event as well. Uh, especially, uh, I'm in the Dallas area. I'm telling you, some of the RF here, it's super difficult. A lot of the cities are Chicago, Phoenix, um, Orlando, New York. There's a lot of really difficult areas for RF. And uh, this system is super hard to take down. Um, it's almost bulletproof. Um, and happy to bring it to any event um, that's looking to have this type of quality. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.